kumquat. Now, in my last video, I might have mentioned that I needed to play mono white control. So, that's exactly what I did. Today we played mono white control. And it didn't do too bad. Now, I didn't fully feel comfortable with this deck because this was my first run at it. However, as usual, I went seven and three as you can see here now I don't know what is going on but seven and three has been my zone over the last several decks that I've played I'll take it whatever now uh, I could have gone eight and two but there was a point in a game where I could have uh, I could have hit for lethal I missed it by one didn't see it till afterwards and the guy took me out the next turn and that was pretty devastating that was that was my ninth game uh, so I had a chance to go eight and two and I didn't anyway no more talking let's get to the playing but first don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe there are 86 percent of you out there watching my videos but not subscribing so please take that half a second and hit the button it would really really help the channel out. I hope you enjoy the games. Take care my friends. This looks like a good hand here. I am going first again. So that's good. If Liz Erratic shows up I would say Liz is being very erratic right now okie dokie So Liz is here. What are we doing? Liz Erratic playing some Selesnian Chains. All right. be dealing with the um, the freaking tree thingy with uh, wandering in for the kami. Couldn't think of its name for a second. Next turn, that would be the best. Ooh. Well, uh, that kind of changes things. Kind of changes things. Time to get greedy. Unless this really hurts. If it only kind of hurts, then uh, we'll save it for the sun. Okay. I'll oh, play some more, please, Liz. No. All right. Well, uh, it only kind of hurts, so we will. All righty. You want to play another card, Liz? I, I, I'll be happy for. Unfall. Now, if uh, my experience with Selesnya enchantments continues, uh, with that many cards in hand, this board is getting completely rebuilt. Started with this little Sheba 
in you, dog. Okay. Classification on uh, on these little guys. That's a confirmation. I'm dealing with a little bit of desperation here, so I'm feeling good. Only one card in hand. Uh, the commies are exiled, and I think yeah, it's time to just uh, go on the offensive. You know you're not playing very erratically, you're playing pretty, uh, well, what we would expect from a Slaznian enchantment player. Let's see what we got coming. attack first and then uh, see what oh well, you know what she does based on uh, blocking here no blocks okay uh, we'll just play loyalty then one card what's what you got uh, okay so that's probably a yeah, good game good game Liz Erratic. good game Curious George. This one's not curious, or he used to be curious, and then he found something that he didn't really want to find. And of course he's playing Mono Red. But he's on the play. Definitely like a turn to pass for Mono Red. Okay. Lightning strike to the face. Good. Good. Squee. Alright. Sure. Okay. So now we'll bring down the Paragon. I like to think that, that uh, gives me a pretty good wall. Alright, so this is... Okay, alright, well... Uh... Let's double block here. buys me a little bit more time. Uh, I don't have to sunfall just yet. That's the turn. Yeah. It's not going 
to my face, so I'm happy with that. Bringing the old squee. Oh, this is a new squee. Never mind. Gain that life. Okay. Well. Yep. Have that life gain. So this is a good time to sunfall. He doesn't have enough to bring back the other squee yet. Doesn't mean he can't put something in there. He only needs one more card. But hopefully, hopefully, he has nothing. And Furious George can live up to his name of being furious. All right. Okay. Mono Red. You're so funny. Well, okay. One card in hand. Let's see. Let's take out the Mishra's Foundry. I'll just pass the turn. Um, still have my Phyrexian token. Elspeth here, and I'm gonna give my token life link. Every job is an opportunity to learn. Show them what you've got. So being at nine is much better, and uh, and uh, it just you know allows me to hold on to the sunfall. Just another turn, basically. Even though technically he could put me at five here if he wanted to, and then burn me down from there with with cards in his hand. That's weird. <laughs> well, if it's a fight you want. Mono red, man. They just uh, uh, don't make sense sometimes. So uh, we'll give this thing vigilance now. Let's do this together. And we'll attack him. Okay. Yeah, okay, see, I mean, I guess he just saw that he wasn't, he, he wasn't going anywhere. Good game. Okay, now, a couple clay, uh, fired bricks here. 
What are we playing against? Tomohiko. Tomohiko. It's a Tomohiko. Hiko. <laughs> it's a Tomohiko, Mr. Robotical. Okay, it's a mono black. Cause troll, he's going <laughs> right for the the <laughs> right right to mess him with my hand here. So, all right, I'll give him a land. That's fine. Let's do some uh, bounce shenanigans with this. That'll give me. I'll just keep getting. Uh, well, I mean, at least this once, I'll get a uh, a land I can dump. Yeah, that's fine. I'm tired of your secret. That's fine. Uh, we'll get rid of the other bricks because I could bring that back with the Sarah Paragon. Okay. See, what I like about this is he's already down to two cards. So he's like, he's screwing himself a little, a little harder than, than anything. With that Liliana, she's just, I mean, she's not doing, not really doing the work here that I, that I would expect her to do. I mean, I just, I feel like he's getting the worst end of the stick here. I've done the don't lands and cards I didn't need and okay hello I just I just don't know I, I just don't feel like uh let's force him to use this Liliana right let's force him because I find it, most people that ultimate Liliana, they, they try to do too much. What you gonna do, Tomohiko? You gonna mine us, sir? Ultimate it? Ultimate it is. Okay. Let's see what he does. Just separate him. Lands and other permanents. Don't complicate it. Lands and other permanents. That's, that's all you need to do. Lands and other permanents. Maybe one land in the other permanent. Uh, in the permanent pile. At the most. Wait a second. I guess it's the dumbest thing I've seen. Like, why would you give... That's a, that is an easy... That is a, that is an easy take. Okay, so now he's going to. And you think you can win. I still. I've always hated. I think that was a bad idea. So oops, oops to you, Tomohiko. Oops to you. I think that was a bad idea. I just do. You're not going to convince me otherwise. I think this whole game plan of Tomohiko's has been poor, really, because he's screwed his own hand up. Let's take out this Liliana here. Be his only game plan, and I'm at 26. I, ain't, I am not worried about this uh, graveyard you trespasser. Time. Sure. All right, Tomohiko. Let's see what you got. Nothing, except a scoop. Up against 
Eve gum. Check to see. Uh, so he's not the 68 card land deck. Okay. So is he just mono green? Alright. Little little ramp. Mono green ramp action here. Bringing in the uh, the hedge, the shrubbery. Okay, I don't know if they had any enchantments that the third half can do anything to. Okay, that's a big old dinosaur. I've got the uh, emperor if he decides to tack in with him. Still can't attack with the shrubbery, so I think holding here is good. Let him uh, let him cycle through his lands. That's fine. But the sun falls also, you know, if it gets too out of control like it seems to. And he's down to two cards in hand. So... to take out the uh, the Auger here because I don't want to take 10. I would have taken uh, 6, but getting the shrubbery online is was key there. Um, so let's just go ahead and wipe it now. <sighs> just to go ahead and uh, wipe it. Sudden, there's a Nissa that I cannot answer. One thing I've noticed in these games is I haven't seen Get Lost hardly at all. Hardly at all. I, I don't know if I've even seen it thinking about it now. Mm, I don't want to sunfall here. But, uh,. Do it this way. Okay, try to see if uh, we can get through here. And he lets us through for a little bit, so that's good. At least these things are going to be smaller when they come out. Okay. Mono green with haste. That's a. Uh, that's Enough fair. Resistance. That is fair. Mono green with haste. Our swords will cross again. Mm, yep. Just thinking here that I can handle the small ones.
this man, this guy. Like he just keeps coming. <sighs> I just I don't want him to get that because What you gonna do, e Eve Gam? Eve Gam? IV Gam? Alright, uh. Okay, so he's, he's kind of thinking about it. I know I don't have any more sunfalls. I'm gonna let him have it, cause I've I've got to take uh, I gotta I gotta do something about this Nissa. This is getting a little out of hand. Um, four, nine, thirteen, sixteen. I guess uh, I'll just I'll do what I can. There's a get lost. Came with the green hasties, but none of the green trampolines. All of the invasions of Zendikar. Oh, he's coming at us. All right. Well, well I think we can uh, manage this pretty good, so... Two of his guys, and only lose, you know, a couple of bars. Yeah. Good for you, Steve Gam. I'm, uh, you know, you can gain all the life. I think, you, I think you've got all the land in your in play. This is fine. Everything's fine. It's just gaining a bunch of life. So, I feel what this does is now gives me 
another turn. He's trying to come up with a solution here, and he's down to two dudes and top decking, but that's a good top deck, by the way. Make a Mirex. Play the Lorraine again. This time I'll take out that map token. Got the wide board, huh? Bring it down, your Ogier. We'll just kill him and then take out that land with a field of ruin. Make another Mirix token and use that. Next turn with the. Uh, Play tab thingies. This puts him on a three turn block. And I still have plenty of blockers. Plenty of blockers. Alright. Okay. Yep. Plenty of a blockers if game For a second I thought he stalled out he was like oh lord, but no He's mono green. He thinks to himself. I have these big creatures However They are not big enough. And I gain two life. Let's go. Goodbye land. Heck yes. Heckin' right. <laughs> Heckin' right. Okay. Ooh, another get lost. Rex and pop the clay fire bricks. Boom! Look at these big baddies. I can, I can fly over top for 12 now. I think if Gam, that's a GG. Yeah, he thinks so too. Good game, Mono Green. Good game. Hmm. Well, uh, him, Roy. Let's see what a two lander does. I wouldn't have taken it, but I knew I could get a. Uh, planes with this bad boy here and uh, turn us straight into a three lander which I could theoretically play the realm breaker and start taking some of his lands but instead I'm gonna do this and get a body and So it looks like M. Roy is playing Azorius Control. I have to say that with a sort of question mark because you never know with these games I'm getting. I don't want to play the Realm Breaker into a counter because if 
he is holding a counter and is playing control, then Realm Breaker may end up be, become a win condition. And this proves that he is playing control. go do this again or not okay I'm fine with that I am fine with that yeah uh, it looks like he's officially in Drago form Um, let's attack. Yeah, let's see if he has another count. Why not? Yeah, sure does. What in the world is that? I can see who plays that. That's a terrible, that's a terrible card. This like budget Azorius control. It plays one Emperor, one No More Lies. I don't know. I, I kind of I'm feeling right now that his. Let's just. See. See, there's no way he has a third counter. Yeah. I'm thinking his priority is one of the lands. This will really put it to the test. Yep. Displays. I, I, I will not. I will not believe those are good cards. We just keep grinding this one. Just keep, uh. I mean, he's at 10. I know that's not saying anything with Azoria's uh, control, but, uh. I don't know. I think, I think we can grind this one out. He's only got three cards at hand and that will. I'm not really scared of the will. I'm scared of the fact that I've only got a few lands. Let's go ahead and start taking out his man lands here, because that's probably his winning condition. Alright, M. Roy. Nothing. Okay, well, this is... Let's... I don't think he has a counter. I really don't. Uh, yeah, good. So that helps us. Can't play this yet because I'm not that of an idiot. But we can play the more land destruction. That gives me two life. Sure. Okay. Alrighty. Just take it. I mean, we're at 
24, no big deal. See if I can play the Realm Breaker. Three cards. Yeah, he's. We're good. Let's take out the other man. One of the other man lands. And honestly, what I can do here next is. I can use Realm Breaker and take his uh, <clears throat> his lands. So yeah, probably should have attacked in there. I don't know why I didn't. Okay. Field of Ruins, so. I'll take a Restless Anchorage of my own. Hmm, good, yeah, put that map on there. Alrighty. Go ahead and let's just let him know what's up. I don't have anything to activate it but itself. Uh, so we need more of his land. Uh, I'm going to take the archive, I think, so I can surveil. Yeah. yeah. No. Uh, I mean, it could activate. No. No. It's, uh... I was thinking about taking that for blue, but, uh... The other one is already activating twice for it. I don't need blue now. Blue, white control, what you gonna do? You're going to memory deluge. In first main phase, wow. A seven mana memory deluge in first main phase that's desperation Holmes I smell blood in the water and when I smell blood in the water oh my mold starts bubbling this kumquats little little orangey hairs start tingling just want to burst out because I'm coming for you Emroy You may have come in here with control, but I came in with simpler control. I better not speak too soon. In the meantime, we will continue to take his anchorages and use his anchorages against him because he's only at 10. So, uh -huh. okay, 
That's fine. That is fine. We will just get it back next turn. Not a big deal at all. And it looks like he's out of basics. He's got two other Field of Ruins over there, so... More desperation. Yes, sir. He's at 25 cards at this point. Maybe we just deck him. Surely he's not playing just one Emperor and one No More Lies. Like, surely. Right? Like, all these, all these cards he's been playing... And like two memory deluges. <laughs> I'm just really curious as to what is his wind condition. These things. Like I would never use to do so. Maybe, I mean, not in a control. Ooh, that's a card. Let's see if this one gets through. First, we're going to um, make us a little couple gnomes here. A couple three threes. Take a. Take another Anchorage. Two swamps left. And we'll pass the turn. What do you got, Emroy? This this game's been dragging on, I have to say. Which I guess is expected with two Control players. Oh, temporary lock. Oh, that is bad. I mean, I could get it back. But, uh, yeah, let's get it back. Yeah, he couldn't take any more of the Kung Kwong. 